AI will transform the way education is offered and accessed. So it will make high quality education a mass product which is affordable for everyone. I think the first things that we're already seeing uh, used in education are AI applications that help people interact with each other. So online interaction, online communities that help us build that community that is so central when we're learning. In the future, all of us will need to understand the basics of computers and all of us will need to understand how to communicate with people because the majority of jobs will be handled by both a human being and a robot side by side. AI allows to make education personalized. This is no problem for an AI algorithm which analyzes the learning behavior or the learning pattern of students and adapts the course contents or course activities to optimally support the learning success of individual students. Well, I think in AI, the quality of data is almost everything. As we tend to say, garbage in, garbage out. So if you put bad quality data into the system and uh, try and use that for something, then the result usually is bad as well. And that we have already seen in many occasions uh, when we have applied machine learning in uh, important decision making. The problem there is that we can have human biases that are in the data as a consequence of humans making biased decisions. There's a positive thing in the sense that our human biases are very hard to identify and rectify, but the biases in the algorithm can be detected and measured, and then we can work our way to, to get rid of them. AI is not only a technical question, it's really a very broad societal issue that is changing society and changing the way we learn. And therefore, it, we can't leave uh, AI into the hands of the engineers or the coders that develop systems. And I would really like to challenge everyone to learn at least the basics of AI. We discuss the ethical consequences of artificial intelligence a lot. And of course, this, this is very important because as soon as computers start making decisions that affect people's lives, then those decisions have to be ethical and they have to be socially justifiable. They should not discriminate against any certain groups of people. More research is needed. European policymakers should ensure that research is done in Europe where we share common European values. We really need to come together on the EU level and on the global level to join forces and to find enough of consensus to put in regulation and to solve the big problems that we're still facing in this area. So I think AI is an area where collaboration is really fundamental.